for those companies who are thinking about making this change to their um, operations, like what would be your, I mean, you mentioned the culture being important, but what would the one thing they need to get into place to ensure that their operations run smoothly if they're going to introduce remote work? Yeah, that's a really great question. One of the biggest things would be to ensure that you have a framework and a foundation to be able to support that. And, and what that would look like potentially is, you know, having really good internal processes and systems to be able to support both the workflow. And when you have that, it allows, you know, leadership and one another to be able to know where we're all at, right? And that might be, you know, having a really good CRM, having a collaboration tool such as Basecamp, you know, going back and forth on Slack, constantly so even though it doesn't we're not in the same room it starts to feel like we're in the same room so when you have a system that's set up with a foundation of tag you're it i've done my task now it's your turn now it's your turn then um, it makes it a lot simpler and it a lot it's a lot easier and it allows organizations to keep a level of integrity within with what they're up to because everything is captured in fact i would argue but the level of integrity for an organization is probably higher when it's remote work versus when you're bricks and mortars, because that's where you, you know, shout down the hall and say, okay, John, you know, it's, I'm done with this. Why don't you run with it now? And then John's going to be like, I, I don't remember you telling me that. Whereas now it's like, I'm done. I'm going to assign a task over to Des. She's going to run with it, go this length with it, and then possibly pass it off to somebody else. And it's not about make wrong. It's about, supporting an environment of accountability, which um, no matter what makes you feel like you're, when you're in an environment where there's integrity and accountability, you always feel like you're getting stuff done and you feel like you're succeeding and you get off at the end of the day, you can check a box and say, I had a good day because I got this, this, and this done. And again, a really good framework really allows you to be able to do that. So I think that's super critical. Um, I think the other really important element is having social activities. And I think if you're a remote team, but you're within the same city or driving distance, I would strongly encourage, you know, even once a week if you can do it, but at the very least once a month, to be able to get together in a co-working space or have drinks after work, the stuff that most teams that are bricks and mortars have the luxury of doing. So really you know, um, encourage that. And if you are a global team like we are, then once a month we have, you know, um, social time. So, you know, you get on to a Zoom meeting and it's not about work, you're talking about fun stuff. And you have, you know, a, a team within your team or that, that time together is robust and fun and not just people showing up and not knowing what to talk about. So, you know, be committed to that because as I said, a team that, um, plays well together will always work well together and you're not going to have that play time if you don't carve that time out to be able to have that time one more thing that I would say it's the future, the future. this is the future of work so if you do not figure out today agree. and put that put the system in place to lean towards that future then you're going to get left behind so learning and figuring out and understanding how you're going to make all of this work do it today and map it out so you can actually get it on the court. I think yeah. that's a great note to kind of wrap it up on, Kel. Thank you so much for joining me today and sharing those insights. Um, I think this is, this is great stuff to, to show how people can embrace this new way of working and not be afraid of it and use it to, if anything, increase efficiencies, increase productivity, and have loads and loads of fun.